happy 21st of December. We're getting so close to Christmas. Now this morning you would have opened your flat and you have got our Christmas flaky man grind. So this is something I'm sure you all know and love or I hope you all know and love. If you don't, this is our flaked salt version of our man grind seasoning. So you don't need a grinder or anything. The reason we've put it in the advent is because this seasoning is used in heaps of the other recipes in the advent. So we thought we're gonna make sure you guys have it on hand. So it's gonna be quite crucial to lots of your dishes on Christmas day, possibly. Today's recipe, obviously everything uses mangrind. Mangrind you can just use instead of salt and pepper on everything. And what we thought we'd do is give you another little bonus recipe using the mushy powder that you would have got on day something. So Cam did the arancini balls with the mushy powder, but you can also use this to make a really, really epic peppercorn or mushroom sauce. It's great to like boost any flavor in pastas or risottos or anything like that. It's really, really cool little seasoning here. So I wanted to show you something else to do with it um, and then using the mangrove flaky. So today's recipe is the mushroom sauce. It's actually not got any mushrooms in it. You can add mushrooms in, just start by cooking off a couple of cups of sliced mushrooms first, add all the other ingredients and then simmer it down. You've got a really good mushroom sauce or the mushroom sauce in the recipe, it's more of a, like a peppercorn mushroom sauce. You basically add everything into a pot and stir it. So I'm gonna use one tablespoon of peppercorns ground. This is pepper on me, I've just pre-ground it. So I'm gonna use a nice tablespoon of that, so it'll be nice and peppery. Get that in your pan, and then you want three tablespoons of your magic mushy dust. One, two, three. Half a cup of stock, you can use beef, chicken, or veggie, what's that? You want some balsamic vinegar? I've got a white balsamic vinegar, fancy, but you can use whatever balsamic you've got on hand. It's a nice, nice teaspoon of that, brings a little bit of sharpness to it. Mangrove flaky, just half a teaspoon. Oh, it says half, half of a mangrove flakes. It's half a teaspoon of mangrove flakes. Didn't check that one, did we? And one cup of cream. You could use coconut cream if you want a dairy-free sauce. So we're just whisking this together, bring it to a simmer, reduce it down for a little bit, and you've got a beautiful peppercorn mushroom flavored sauce. You could fill it with chunky mushrooms. In the picture, we served it with the eye fillet from day one with the double shot, and that's a really good sauce for that steak as well, but it's also really good as like a chicken gravy, creamy mushrooms for breakfast. Peppercorn sauce on absolutely any steak is just magic. You could use this sauce once it's thickened and sort of cook off some mince or some steak and use this and make a pepper steak pie. Beautiful mushroom gravy. It's boiling now. You want to simmer it till it's the thickness that you want. You'll see all those chunks of porcini mushrooms start to rise up to the surface. About three or four minutes of the simmer should be perfect, nice, thick sauce consistency. Pour it into your serving jug. Yum. Delicious. Get your beautiful steak cooked to however you like it. Just spoon that mushroom sauce on. Mushroom peppercorn this one anyway. Delicious. Enjoy.